Hello, and welcome to my science fair project. My name is Sarah, and I will be guiding you through the scientific method in my science experiment. Shall we begin? Every good science experiment begins with a purpose. The purpose of my experiment is to learn about chemical reactions and determine if a chemical reaction has occurred. In class, I learned that a chemical reaction or chemical change happens when a substance is changed into one or more new substances. I know a chemical change has occurred if the substance changed colors, produces a gas, or creates heat. Now that I have my research, it is time for me to make an educated guess about chemical reactions. My hypothesis is that when I combine vinegar and baking soda, a chemical change will occur. However, I think when I combine water and baking soda, that a chemical change will not occur. Before beginning my experiment, it's important that I gathered all my materials. I needed a box of baking soda, a bottle of vinegar, two empty bottles, two balloons, and a spoon. Once my materials were gathered, I was ready to begin. First, I started with bottle A, which combined water and baking soda. I filled bottle A halfway with water. Then, I added a spoonful of baking soda. Next, I placed the balloon over the top of the bottle and waited for a reaction. Nothing happened and the balloon stayed deflated. Next, I took bottle B and filled it halfway with vinegar. Then I added a spoonful of baking soda to the bottle. Immediately, I noticed that it was bubbling. I quickly put the balloon over the top of the bottle, and it instantly began to blow up the balloon. Now that my experiment is done, it's time to analyze my results. Bottle A did absolutely nothing when I added baking soda. Using what I know about chemical reactions, I know that no chemical reaction happened. Bottle B, though, is different. It instantly bubbled and the balloon was filled with gas. This is a sign that a chemical reaction has occurred because a gas was produced. My conclusion is that both of my hypotheses were correct. Bottle A with water and baking soda did not cause a chemical reaction, but bottle B with vinegar and baking soda did because the balloon inflated. Thanks for coming, and I hope you enjoyed my science experiment. She blinded me with science.